Today on MTG Unpacked, we're cracking into three more packs of Shadows over in Estrad, and I have Gideon here to do the pack blessings today. Hopefully that'll get us some great juicy pulls. So let's get stuck into this. Alright, we start off with Emissary of the Sleepless, Jace's Scrutiny, Cathar's Companion, Intrepid Provisioner. Root Out, Rotten Heart Ghoul, Reduced to Ashes, Rabid Bite, Arms of the Vein, and for the Uncommons we have Haunted Cloak, Forsaken Sanctuary, that's pretty decent, Biting Rain, and Rare is Second Harvest, so this is an instant for 4 mana. For each token you control, put a token on the battlefield that's a copy of that permanent. Alright, that seems good. And a flip card, we have a Lambholt Pacifist. Flips into a Lambholt Butcher. Another one of those lovely werewolves. And a checklist and a clue token. That one's a little different than what I've seen before. Okay, on to pack number two, Gideon, we need some crazy pulls here, I know there's not much value to be had here, but there's always foils, right? Next up, Thraven Inspector, Silberlin Snapper, what? Oh, a giant turtle. Okay, Militant Inquisitor, Hound of the Farbogs, Deadweight, Ember Eye Wolf. Equestrian Skill, Macabre Waltz. Now that is some fantastic artwork. Artwork. I like the, um, you can actually get a playmat with this. That is pretty cool. Pyrehound. And, but not creepy at all, Tooth Collector. Would you like some teeth? You need some spare teeth? No? Well, I've got some for you anyway. Stencia Masquerade. Some more crazy vampires. Griff Spoon. And a rare prized amalgam. Ooh. So this is a creature zombie 3-3 three, three for 3 mana. Whenever a creature enters the battlefield, if it entered from your graveyard or you cast it from your graveyard, returned prized amalgam from your graveyard to the battlefield tapped at the beginning of the next end step. Alright, so when you get... Or if you cast it from your graveyard... Okay, yeah, so you get this back. That seems pretty cool. And our flipper is a Hermit of the Natanols. Let me guess, a Werewolf. Yes, Lone Wolf of the Natanols. What a surprise. And a checklist and a clue token. Now that is also a surprise. Another clue token. Okay, last pack. we got to get something crazy here. Catalog. Survive the Night. Oh, I need to take a closer look at that. That is quite creepy. I'm going to set that aside for my common pick. Stitched Mangler, Strength of Arms, Magmatic Chasm, Ghoul Caller's Accomplice, Throttle, Sanguinary Mage, Stoic Builder, and the uncommons we have Geese's Bidding. That is weird, okay. Incorrigible Youths, Fleeting Memories, and rare is a Drownyard Temple. So this is a land, you can tap, add colorless mana to your mana pool, or pay three, return Drownyard Temple from your graveyard to the battlefield tapped. And a Hinterland Logger flips into a Timber Shredder. So that's just a common, and a forest, and a clue token. Okay, so my picks in the rare slot. I'm going to say prized amalgam. I like how you can get it back. And that is some pretty cool artwork. In the uncommon slot, I'm going to take a closer look at this one. This is creepy as anything. 
Geese's Bidding. Geese's Bidding, I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Sorcery for 4 mana. Put two, 2 2 black zombie creature tokens onto the battlefield, and Madness is 2 in a swamp. If you discard this card, discard it into exile when you do cast it for its madness cost or put it into your graveyard. And the common, I wanted to look at that, but if there's anything better, uh, let's see here. Macabre Waltz is pretty cool. Um, Alright, I will look at this one a little closer then. Survive the Night. So we've got some creepy zombie scene here. Instant for 3 mana. Target creature gets plus 1 plus 0 and gains indestructible until end of turn. So damage and effects that say destroy, do not destroy it, and investigate. Put a colorless clue artifact token onto the battlefield with tap, sacrifice this artifact, draw a card. Alright, so if you agree or disagree with my picks, leave a note in the comments. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button for more Magic the Gathering unboxings, and be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released, and have a great day.